Hey, welcome back to Scale Speedworks. My name's Mike. I'm sorry I haven't posted in quite some time. It's amazing how busy it gets uh, this time of year. November, my son's birthday. December, my wife's birthday. Happy 40th. January, my daughter's birthday. And February coming up, mine. But yeah, boy, busy with the holidays and dealing with my elderly parents as well. That's not easy for those of you who have to deal with relatives and be their caregivers. However, that's enough of me and, and my problems and my excuses. Again, just a real quick channel update. I'd like to go over a couple of things that I got for the holidays and a little workbench update here. So here we go. First and foremost, real excited to get this. Brand new. Yeah, real nice. So I will be setting this up and playing with this uh, as soon as I get a chance. This thing's nice. Real, real excited about my new uh, Pro Convoy airbrush. Um, of course, the accessories got the hose. Um, got a little, uh, airbrush cleaning pot. Again, everything that I got is on Amazon. Uh, I can link it in the description below. I'm also excited about, it's a hot knife. So it's kind of like a soldering iron, but with a couple of number 11 blades on it. So I'm going to be using this. I got a, a project for that. Um, that ambulance, uh, build that I showed a little while ago, and I'll throw a link up here, up in the corner. Uh, I'm going to use this knife on that to cut open some of the doors. So excited to play with that. feels like I've been collecting model kits left and right. I've been organizing them as well. I've been <laughs> clearing out room out of my wife's office, but, uh, but I've been organizing them and I, I grouped them in the, the bins that I have. I labeled the bins and I even created an Excel spreadsheet. To keep track of what kits I have and what box they're in. Just a little bit of blue uh, painter's tape on the sides of the box and, and a number. Uh, and then I can refer to that in the Excel spreadsheet and see what box they're in in case I need quick access to one of my kits. Yeah, unlikely. But I put a lot of information up there and, and uh, I'll see if I can show you guys the Excel spreadsheet, if I can uh, put a shot of that on the screen just to kind of show you um, how I organized it. And, uh, and maybe that'll help you guys as well. You know, because often I'm browsing eBay, uh, looking for kits and I'll, I'll find one and I'll say, Hey man, that's a great kit. I'm not sure if I have it or not. So I'll put a bit on it now and figure it out later. And for, for those of you who don't want or don't need two, three copies of the same kit, this is a good way to keep track. And, uh, and I'll be more than happy to, to share this with you guys. Real, I'm, I'm not very good at Excel. I just created a, a simple spreadsheet. And, and that way I can, I can keep track and I can know where everything's at. Glad to wrap up 2021. I finished all of three quarters, maybe 90% of one build. And that was a pro street group build. I still got a couple on my bench and I am working to get those done. I, I currently have a Ford F-150 Lightning, which I'm converting into the Ford uh, expedition. Um, it's a Ravel snap tight expedition kit. I'm going to be have, having that up on the channel real soon here. Almost done. Almost done. I just, I just need to throw everything in paint and, and do a little bit of assembly. So I hope to get that up real soon. Also have, and I'm looking at it right now is my machine and Krieger, um, Falky bomber. And I'm hoping, hoping to get that done real quick as well. And I got a bunch of plans for that. I'm real excited about that kit. Uh, that should be a lot of fun. And boy, it seems like I just <laughs> I just have kit after kit after kit. The poor uh, UPS driver, uh, as well as FedEx and the post office, I seem to be at my door every day with a package. Hopefully, I've, I've solved my model cravings for a little while, and I can start building instead of buying. Again, uh, apologies. Uh, it's been a little while since I've, I've been able to get a video out. I have been watching and commenting on your videos and I'd like to throw a special shout out out there to Mr. Mark Batson. Uh, thank you, sir, for serving your community. 
Um, not sure how long you were in the profession, but uh, I'm sure it wasn't easy then, and I can tell you it's not easy now. But thank you, sir. Uh, and again, thanks to all you guys out there, all my subscribers. Thanks for watching. Thanks for commenting on my videos. I really appreciate it. And again, uh, I apologize for not being able to post content. I, I like to share my builds and share my videos and share my ideas. But I also really enjoy watching your videos and seeing your builds and your ideas. And uh, you guys are, are pretty talented. Again, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And uh, hopefully I'll get more content up on my channel real soon. But in the meantime, keep on modeling and I'll see you guys on the next one.